A deputy from McCrary County, Kentucky is home recovering. He was shot last week in the line of duty. 28 year old Tyler Watkins has served as a deputy for just the last six months. Troopers say he was on a call for a welfare check when he was shot Tuesday night. WBIR 10 News reporter Stephanie Haynes spoke to his family. His mother says she heard that shooting unfold over a police scanner. Beth Watkins had a mother's intuition Tuesday night in the worst way. So I knew in my heart that it was him. Watkins was listening to the police scanner and heard that a deputy had been shot. She said they were calling for her son's number, but he wasn't answering. So she ran out to find him as crews were putting him into a helicopter bound for UT Medical Center. When I said, Tyler, mommy's here, mommy's here, he shook his head yes. Now, Deputy Tyler Watkins is at home recovering. It's amazing how strong he is and and um, just everything that he went through, you can't even tell. Family says Watkins was shot in the abdomen area and chest and was wearing a bulletproof vest. He had two surgeries and on his way home Sunday, law enforcement escorted them and lined the streets for his arrival. But people were outside in the rain. Um, Tyler said it made him tear up. Deputy Watkins had wanted to be in law enforcement his whole life, also serving on the volunteer Whitley City Fire Department. The sheriff's office says the deputy was serving on a volunteer basis and was just approved for salary July 1st. He would have been the fourth paid deputy and we have about uh, eight volunteer deputies. He had just passed a physical test and was headed for the Kentucky Police Academy and family doesn't fear this will set him back. He's very hard headed and determined and I think if he says six or seven weeks, he'll be up in six or seven weeks. In McCreary County, Kentucky, Stephanie Haynes, WBIR 10 News. Deputy Watkins said in a statement to 10 News he is thankful for all the support. The suspect faces an attempted murder charge and is expected to be in court next week.